Fargo Truck TV. The It's Been Driving episode. We got it together. Took it off to Mission Raceway Park. Visited some people out on the coast. We've just been back from there. Put about 2,500 kilometers on it. If you haven't been following the build, a quick review. I'll review everything since this is kind of probably the last one for a while since uh, it's done and driving. Truck is a 49 Fargo B1B. Uh, I've done some body modifications to it to subtle, try and sleeken it a little bit. Widen the rear fenders, use some big truck fenders on the front, line them all up with the running boards. We've got our little slip tank here that we're using for fuel. Underneath, we're running a B body 8 and 3 quarter Mopar on a four link suspension. 15 by 10 inch wheels. The centers are Ford V8 centers, kind of like the vintage look of them. Uh, and they fit on the wheel nuts, so that was uh, a plus for us as well because there's no tabs on our front wheels. They're 17 inch Crown Victoria wheels. So the baby moons we were using on the rear wouldn't work on the front. In any case, uh, if you're wondering about the lettering, Danforth Cartage. Danforth Cartage was my grandfather's company in Ontario. Uh, I wanted some door art and I thought why not make it real? Why not use door art? That's legit. That's uh, got some history to it. This truck has no tie to my grandfather's company other than uh, that it's mine. And yeah, he was my grandfather. In any case, uh, the door art itself is actually legit. It's pictures taken from pictures of old trucks provided to me by my uncle. Engine, big block Mopar. I was just at a show in Red Deer. There was two trucks of this vintage, well none quite this old. There was a 54 and a 56, both Dodges, neither one Fargo's. Uh, both had small block Chevys in them. I guess, you know, they must have lost the Camaros that the engines went with, but to each their own. Uh, yeah, 26 inch Mopar radiator, uh, big block Mopar, Demon carburetor. We drove out to the track. We raced her at an old event. It was a lot of fun. Old time drag event. Only vehicles older than 1970 were allowed in that. We drove this on our 68 Monaco out. Uh, and had a heck of a good time. Found out from a gentleman who appraised the truck that the front bumper, the upside down car bumper that's on the truck, was actually a fairly common trick for hot rodders. Uh, I'd never heard of it, but it's old school, I guess. And uh, I like it, it goes with it. Bumper could be a little straighter. Maybe we'll get it straightened out and chromed in the next couple of years. But uh, yeah. Big block Mopar, 727, Crown Vic front end on the front, B-body Dodge on the back, it's eight and three quarter, our uh, wood deck, which matches our wood headliner, racers tape seat, nine hole billet steering wheel, vintage Kenwood cassette deck, the cassette deck is uh, where the gauges would have gone if you're familiar with these trucks. And I've added modern gauges over here. Uh, speaker grills, the Speedo would have actually been here originally. But that is a factory speaker grill over there and, and here from another truck that we added it. Stereo, uh, it works. We just use it for the FM. We use an FM uh, transponder and broadcast from an iPod. So we just listen to iPod music when we're in it. And, uh, yeah, that's it. It's been beauty. Vacuum wipers are functional. We, that was our, one of our last obstacles before the trip, was we had no wipers. But we got, uh, the original motor from this truck was no good. Um, I got one from a local guy who had a few of these trucks, and uh, it worked. So uh, it's in there, it worked. We used it on the trip, uh, controlled by the little, little lever there up on the center of the dash. And uh, put a little bit of carpet in it, but that's about it. One switch for the line lock. The other switch is not uh, in use yet.
special thanks to all who've taken an interest in the uh, the build and uh, to everybody who's helped out along the way, like uh, Thor up at Phoenix Automotive and, uh, well, anybody else who helped me. Have a good one.